On a Monday night, gunshots rang out right outside Karen Bailey's Russell neighborhood home. And although she wasn't the intended target, the most unlikeliest item was a matter between life or death. The pillow was right here. This is where I sleep. Karen Bailey was frantically woken out of her sleep to the sound of gunshots near her home on 18th Street. All at once I heard pow, 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 pow. Then I heard it again. She says she laid in bed until the gunfire stopped, afraid to move out of fear of getting shot. But unbeknownst to her at the time, she was one pillow away from being struck. There's the hole where the bullet, the police took out of the hole. That could have been me. And this isn't the first time Miss Bailey has been put in danger. Her home is bullet ridden from the dining room to her back bedroom from shootings she says frequently occur in the alley or a popular gas station near her house. One, two, three, four holes in one room. That's one room. She says the bullet holes and shell casings she's collected are a constant reminder of the risk, one she's not willing to take again. She is packing up 20 years of memories and moving out of her home for good. I am done. I am done. I, I love living. Though she doesn't have a plan on where she'll go, Miss Bailey says the ultimate plan is to go somewhere safe. And she hopes those who contribute to the city's violence realize the impact of their actions and make a change. Put the guns down. We all trying to make it out here. Let's come together as one and love each other. That's what God wants us to do. Alexis Matthews, WLKY News.